my name is Nils Berger. I'm the CEO and uh, owner of Viewpoint System. Um, just to give you a few ideas, we're doing smart glasses which have a capability of tracking your eye movements, which means we have three levels. Eye control, that's I see what you see. We have eye perception, I see what you perceive. And what we're working on is eye emotion, that means what you feel while looking at something. So we do believe, and that's what we work hard for, that our smart glasses will put the human being into the digital loop. At the end of the day, I think that smart phones will be replaced by something that is controlled, that is, that is steered by your eye, because your eyes are the most powerful sense you're having, but it's also using most of the brain capacity you're having. So that's our challenge, to come up with a solution that brings you into the digital, digital loop, and we call it the digital iris. So enjoy, touch base with us whenever you have a question. Can we see the glasses? Sure, they're just next to us. Um, we call them the only social acceptable smart glasses. They do look rather normal. Um, that was the purpose, because we didn't want anyone to feel like I'm wearing something strange on my nose or anyone looking at him saying gosh what's that thing in your face so it's all about getting used to normal looking glasses with a high-tech uh, uh, inner part okay one other thing I want to ask you give me an application one that's very nice of you there are dozens one application is you're a, a paramedic you're arriving at an accident you, first of all, you use the glasses for documenting everything because what has not been documented has not happened. Secondly, when you encounter a problem you can't cope with, you have a specialist logging onto your glasses remotely and guiding you through the next things you have to do to stabilize the patient or whatever. An alternative is you would like to make that available now for a group of students so you can show that to them so they can be trained how to react in such uh, particular situations. Within law enforcement, it's very important to understand how do human beings view, is there a viewing strategy? And also it's like a body cam, but with way more substance and way more technical gadgets to it. So we could even allow someone else logging onto a police officer's glasses and helping him. Thank you very much. Thank you, Lois.